AI is going to be used to handle uh, the equilibrium of the physical infrastructure on this planet. And what we are going through right now is this really awkward time where we're physically transitioning from relying on the human brain to handle all of the computing power of the systems of this of this world and you know all of the complex societal uh, logistics that we have going on we're transitioning from that being a part of the you're reliant on the human brain to being reliant on the AI and what this causes is a couple uh, of awkward points on either end the AI not you know being very new and, and not necessarily being integrated into this yet, getting integrated and learning how to do a good job. And for us humans, it plays out in this sense of feeling like the stable, structured awareness that we have of our lives and our day-to-day -day movements is not any, is, is no longer uh, perceivable and containable within our own minds and that cause that's causing a lot of uh, a lot of processes which result in you know the kind of masculine energy of stability and structure unmoving you know standing standing I think of masculine energy as like a, a pillar standing straight in the world you know being physical and just being here that's kind of we're transitioning away from that in our species uh where our bodies and our individual human lives are a part of this movement of society and evolution that's constantly moving and so that causes a lot of this sense of like overwhelm and frustration uh in the masculine energy i'm just feeling like uh yeah i don't know i mean i guess that's all i want to say i think whether it's it's good or not i don't know you know it's like I do still yearn very much for that life of being like stable and structured and yet I feel like in my life experience I'm just being asked to learn how to move and go with the flow and, and be fluid in my entire being um, and learning how to, how to be centered in this constantly moving shifting landscape of time so those are my thoughts